Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. So today's question is, what is with the Marthiyas and the Nohas in our centers? I remember going for Ziyarat with Sayyid Aman Akshawani, and in his majlis he was mentioning the history of the structure of our programs in our centers. We have Marthiya, Majlis, Matam. It is actually not ours. We did not make it. It's not a, a Koja thing or an Indian or Pakistani thing. It is actually how the Ahlul Bayt salam structured the Majalis of Imam Hussain. The fourth Imam would ask a poet to recite poetry, which is our Marthiya. He would then remind the people and tell them what happened in Karbala. And then they would remember the Masai of Imam Hussain. Where if you refer to Ziyarat Nahiya, the Ahlul Bayt used to slap their cheeks when they would remember the Masai of Imam Hussain. He also mentioned in that Madlis that when Matam is being recited, if you don't want to stay for all of them, Alhamdulillah in our centers we have three, four Matams, stay for one, out of respect. Just keep your hand on your chest if you don't want to do Matam and listen to the recitation because ultimately it's a recitation, a recitation and remembrance of the Ahlul Bayt so these are the things which he shared and I felt it was important for us to appreciate that this is actually the way the Ahlul Bayt structured uh, Majalis of Muharram which Alhamdulillah we have also got till today. Another thing which I want to mention is this Panjo. You know we say oh, whatever. This actually you find it in Iraq everywhere and it symbolizes the hand that did not give baya and it is still standing tall. This is the sign for it. And Alhamdulillah I've also put uh, the link of uh, Sheikh Hili who has uh, just made 10 etiquettes of um, attending Muharram Majalis which I'm sure will be very beneficial to us all inshallah. Let us remember all those who are unwell around the world with our salawat and let us remember all our marhumin with Surah Al-Mubarak Al-Fatiha. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa